Hello, I made it to Midnight Madness, aka D-Day 9, the two-day event I was talking about in the last video. I brought a whole bunch of shit so I can camp tonight. Uh, I'm about to go get the car teched, and then I can start running, but uh, I brought six spare wheels, two of them being, or four of them being my 18s, my square G6s, and then two 17-inch random ugly wheels. I'm gonna try to only go through the 17s tonight, only do a few runs, and then save four like freshies for tomorrow, but I'm gonna go get teched and start running. Good run. Pretty sure I ran over somebody's tail light though. Alright, so this run I'm about to go on is actually my qualifying lap for the competition tomorrow. So I'm gonna just going to try to take it easy. Uh, it should be no problem qualifying. I really don't care too much about the competition like normal, but if I make it in and I end up competing and doing well, that'd be cool too. Let's see how this goes. I haven't been updating you guys much. There's not been a lot going on. I'm just trying to hang out and uh, wait for tonight where uh, the fun really starts. But uh, I'm about to do uh, a tandem lap with Sam Wisman. He has a black Mustang. He's getting a lot better at driving, so it's gonna be fun to be able to tandem with him, but he will be behind me, so you won't see it. <laughs> That run with Sam went really well, so we're going to do another one, but I'm going to chase him. That was fun. That was the last run of the night though, so it's time to party. Shit, were you saving it tomorrow? You're like, hey, you fucking, fucking You're beautiful. <laughs> so, it is now a little past midnight. Uh, we started the camping. There's not a lot of people here to camp with us, but this is still the first time we've ever camped at Gateway Motorsports Park. We're all drinking, having a great time. Uh, some kids already caught 
a fucking gas can on fire, which was interesting, and I had to fucking put it out. I'm gonna keep having a good time and uh, hopefully don't kick flip my car tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. I'm very hungover. Big shout out to Sam and Reeves for letting me crash in their heated trailer because this shit was nice. It was a very rough night. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to throw up at any second, but the event's starting. <laughs> that trailer definitely made sleeping here a whole lot better. Sleeping on a pull-out couch was really dope, other than an air mattress. I'm gonna need to find some source of water, and then, uh, I guess drive this event. <laughs> Okay, so bad news. The case for my GoPro, the clamp on it broke. So I have no way of mounting my GoPro anywhere. I posted around trying to see if there's anybody that had an extra case lying around, but I can't find anybody that has one. So that sucks because I can't film anything of my driving. And I've done probably like six, eight laps already. And I mean, there's not a lot going on. It's kind of a boring course, but uh, that sucks that I'm not able to film this stuff. So I'm gonna keep looking and try to find a way to make it work. All right, I think I fixed it. I put a zip tie on the GoPro case so it keeps it closed. Good one.
Okay, so competition time. I'm going up against uh, Hockaday in a white fox body. I don't know how it's going to go, and I don't know if I'll throw it this time. I think that I will at some point if I win this battle, but uh, we'll have to wait and see. I think he stayed up with me pretty well, so I don't know if I'll actually win this one or not. I really don't. All right, this is gonna be my second battle. I won the first one with the fox body. But now I'm going up against him. Uh, it's that Schaefer. He has that S13 and it's LS. So I'm probably not going to win this one. He's a very good fucking driver and that car's really quick. So he's going to pull on me. I'm going to, he's leading first. So he's going to pull on me in the first run. So we'll see how it goes. <laughs> to explain that competition a little better I did not win that last battle the way that it worked was he passed me on the last corner but which he shouldn't have done uh, in like an FD rule book but in the rule book here the main rule is to run a midline and not to go inside or outside and I went outside to run the wall and that technically makes it unfollowable for him and so that means that I took the loss on that. And I was actually the one that called that out. Uh, they were gonna give me the, uh, the win on that since he's not supposed to pass in like an FD type competition. But then I brought up the fact that we had one rule and I broke that one rule. And I broke that one rule and so I gave it to him. They, they kind of gave it up to me to make that call and I thought that that was the proper call to make. And I was kind of done with the whole competition thing. I was getting kind of tired of it. I'm not a competition type person, but it was super fun. I enjoyed it a lot. Uh, driving with Schaefer was super cool and driving with uh, Hockaday was cool because I've never done that. Yeah, we're, we're gonna do some runs with Tyler and then I'm gonna call it a day. I feel like ass. Ha 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 ha! 